So again, Tennessee's opioid crisis taking center stage today in Nashville. An opioid summit bringing together law enforcement and health experts. And as state capitol reporter Chris Bungard tells us tonight, many of those on the front lines say there should be a focus on overall causes of drug addiction. Be a joint thing, uh, by county, Henry County, Carroll County, maybe here. Opioid addiction, its dangers, and how to get treatment drew a full house at a Nashville hotel Monday morning. We have to hit it on all cylinders if we're going to make a dent, and I think we are. Along with ways to work with law enforcement, like the sheriff of Henry County, a doctor outlined what he has found in his research. We don't just have an opioid epidemic now, we have a polydrug epidemic. And the real question is, why does America need to self-medicate? Dr. Daniel Sumrock, who has taught addiction at the University of Memphis, in addition to running clinics in Tennessee, cites his reasons why people self-medicate. Our research shows that people make the decisions to use drugs after having suffered adverse childhood experiences. Then there was the Henry County Sheriff, Monty Ballou, who drove two hours to share what he has seen with drugs like fentanyl. The crazy thing about it is people know the dangers of it, but yet they're still doing it. The sheriff also talked of his officers being the first defense of a drug overdose by carrying a life-saving antidote. We're doing a lot of things, preventive things, like the, uh, training all our deputies with Narcan. We carry two dosages, dosages of Narcan on us, on our vest. But that's just one part of the battle for an issue not going away for law enforcement, health care providers, and lawmakers. Reporting from the state capitol, Chris Bungard. Now, it was the second annual opioid summit put on by the group Healthy Tennessee. Hopefully, one step at a time. Let's hope so. Making a difference. Yep.